Hi, good morning. Welcome to this another series lecture about Electrical Wiring Simulator or EWS. Today, we're going to perform the third activity under the AC Alternating Current Series in Parallel Circuits. Okay, click this second menu and then let's go to the third activity entitled Switch Series Bulb. So this is just very similar to the previous activity that we had, the simple series bulbs. But in this particular case, let us uh, add some component a normally open switch. Okay, take note guys that in this particular lecture, in this particular activity, this is only for experimental purposes. Loads should not be connected in series. It should be connected in parallel so that the voltage will not be divided according to uh, the loads. Okay, so click the play and then let's go to the normal mode. Okay, so let's inspect first the, the circuit diagram. So we have the voltage source here. Okay, and we have a normally open switch. This is the normally open switch. And then we have the lamp one, lamp two, lamp one, and then lamp two. So in this particular case, if we turn on the breaker, it means that initially the lamp one and lamp two is turned off. Okay, however, if you switch this button, if you turn on the switch, you create a closed loop. Thus, the current will, will flow from this side to that side, enabling this lamp one and lamp two to turn on. Okay, however, as you can observe, we perform this one in actual. If two loads are connected in series, the voltage, let's assume, for example, the two, two 220 volts supply voltage, so it will be divided accordingly to these two lamps. So 110 volts and then 110 volts. So it is not proper to connect, again, it's not proper to connect loads in series. Okay, so this is only for experimental purposes. Okay, so let's go. So the R, the output of our R should be connected to the uh, number one of our switch okay the next the number two of our switch will be connected to the one of our lamp one okay the two of our lamp one the second terminal of our lamp one will be connected to the first terminal of our lamp two Okay, and then the second terminal will be connected back to the S of our circuit breaker. Okay, let's zoom out so that we can see the wiring. Okay, so it seems correct. Let's click the submit button to check. Okay, pass. So now we can now simulate this push, uh, the circuit. Okay, so if we click this one, the switch. Okay. So the two bulbs will turn on because it will enable the current to flow from this R, go back to our, to the loads and go back to the circuit breaker. Okay, so see you in the next lecture.